Hello, Ben and Jerry's. How may I help you? Uh, yeah, I was uh, calling about this uh, new ice cream flavor I heard about uh, called uh, Hubby Hubby. Uh, what is the deal with that? Well, sir, uh, Ben and Jerry supports love and equal rights, and so we've decided in honor of Vermont's gay marriage law to change the name to Hubby Hubby. Well, I don't, I don't see why ice cream's got to make a political statement. I mean, what happened to, to chocolate, vanilla, and strawberry? Well, sir, we still have our delicious chocolate, vanilla, and strawberry flavors. Well, now we got gay marriage ice cream? I mean, all of a sudden, sodomy is a flavor? What, what exactly does Hubby Hubby, a flavor modeled after two guys fucking each other in the ass, taste like? Uh, no, sir. It's still the same great flavor, just as a different name. So it still tastes like Chubby Hubby? Yes. Well, you see, I get that. Chubby Hubby is obviously so creamy and delicious that it's going to make me chubby. Hence the name Chubby Hubby. It's completely logical. So what's... Hubby Hubby going to make me do? Want to suck a dick? Uh, no, sir. It will still make you chubby and a hubby. Well, look, I'm not trying to be offensive. I'm just I'm just trying to say, where does it stop? Well, I mean, what's next? A carpet munch crunch? <laughs> I mean, how do I explain all this gay ice cream to my granddaughter? Well, sir, uh, perchance you can serve it to her without her seeing the container? So now i got to hide the ice cream container in the same drawer I hide my fetish magazines? That doesn't leave a lot of room for my 24-inch double-sided dildo.